Hey guys, so today's video is going to be on how I have been styling my hair lately. I love the way my hair comes out using this specific tool. Um, so I decided to put on a video for you guys. So this is my hair. I washed it the night before. I have wavy hair, not like a, such a tight curl. It's very easy to just brush it through. So I washed it the night before and it's brush everything through. I didn't blow dry it, but you could blow dry it if you want to. I didn't, I like it because I don't have to. This is the uh, tool that I've been using. It's from FHI Heat. It's the one inch titanium flat iron. And I left this here in real time. It took about 20 seconds to heat it up to its full capacity. I thought that was pretty fast. Uh, I've had uh, flat irons before and they didn't, it seemed like they took forever to heat it up. <laughs> this one went from zero to 450 fast so it took about 20 seconds um so i thought that was pretty cool so here i can you can see i am curling my hair away from my face right around like the parts that the sections that are on around my face i like to curl away so you see the first curl it goes backwards <laughs> um that's what they mean when you uh, when they say curl away from your face curl the the make the curl going backwards so it looks nice and like, kind of like when you, the wind blows <laughs> on your face. Um, that's what I did right there. So I curl all one side off camera and then I'm gonna go and show you on the other side on camera. So towards my roots, uh, on my roots, I just go on the, uh, with the iron, maybe like once or twice, maybe three times, it depending on how curly my hair looks, but I go between an inward curl and an outward curl. Um, so I like to um, do that because the texture looks different and it looks natural. So my hair doesn't aim towards all one side and doesn't look so done up. Um, I hope that makes sense. Uh, but I like to uh, switch it up inward curl and an outward curl. And right there, you can see the smoke coming up. Um, that is not frying my own hair, that is the heat protectant spray that I used on my hair I didn't show that because I applied it all before um, but make sure you do use a heat protectant it's very important otherwise your hair will fry and especially if you do this very often I don't have to do this every day because the curls will last forever uh, like this um, but if you do this often especially use a heat protectant otherwise you will fry your hair so that's a very, very important step. So if you see the smoke, that is not my hair frying. It is the product just kind of, you know, uh, because it heats it up in, in the spray. So it's just how it goes. Anyway, so then you see me going inward, outward, inward, outward. Make sure not to hold the, uh, that's the tricky part. You can't hold the flat iron uh, for too long. You kind of have to twist your wrist, you know, Twist your wrist and kind of pull it through it, otherwise you will have some marks. And then after I curl everything, I just run my fingers through it and you can brush it if you have to, but I like to just shake it all off and I don't need to use hairspray. My hair will stay like this for a long time, for a good four to five days. Uh, so I'm very, very impressed. I will link everything down below for you guys. I don't uh, I don't have an affiliate link, but I do have a discount code for you. It's a pretty pricey product, but very, very, very effective. I hope this was helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.